ladies and gentlemen, our national anthem. Colin Kaepernick, willingness to uh, sit down and when the plan of the national anthem is a symbolic protest, raises the consciousness of all athletes uh, after the issues that are taking place in the country around the abuse of African American men by the police. While people go to sporting events to sort of escape, he is basically telling all those people, look, this is just a game, but there's real negative conduct occurring toward African Americans in the community. The Colin conduct here is in the great tradition of many outstanding African American athletes uh, down through the years. Often, when African American athletes show courage, they also place in jeopardy their careers. Uh, but those who have the courage to do it, uh, it is important for the rest of the community to see because we look up on athletes with great reverence. Kurt Flood will never get into the Hall of Fame for standing uh, up against Major League Baseball, never. In right. he was traded to the uh, Philadelphia Phillies and he said, I'm not going, I'm not a piece of meat to be traded. Jackie Robinson, the whole world was in support of Jackie Robinson. He was a fierce competitor, a strong civil rights advocate, and he had to hold his peace for one year as he integrated Major League Baseball. But once that was done, he let everybody know that he believed in fighting racial discrimination. The most significant person of all is Muhammad Ali. My conscience won't let me go shoot my brother or uh, some darker people uh, some poor, hungry people in the mud for big, powerful America and shoot them for what? They never called me nigger. For Ali, first of all, he lost his title. He lost his belt. He lost his source of income. When Muhammad Ali took his stance, other major athletes from different sports all stood by him. In essence, placed their own social standing and professional standings in question, but yet they stood up. Kareem Jabbar, he stood up. In 1968, I had people criticize me for standing out there. People that felt that the fact that I was getting the opportunity to play in the NBA, I should be very grateful for that and not uh, rock the boat. But uh, the assassination of Dr. King was a tragedy for our country and uh, I wanted to demonstrate my concern with what was going on. He didn't even go to the Olympics that year because he was protesting how African Americans were being treated. In that same Olympics, John Carlos and Tommy Smith, they also protested and they show great courage. I'm so proud of America, but that pride resonates a bit deeper. No matter how good you are, you always have to maintain the idea of becoming better. I think the athletes have a lot of concern about these issues, but I think it's a matter of courage. The people are more concerned not about right, but they're concerned about repercussion. And they have to throw repercussion to the wind and do what's necessary, evaluate the circumstance. Search your soul and search your moral fiber to see whether you have conviction enough to bring your courage up. I can remember very, very clearly as a young boy, uh, Jim Brown, uh, as he was uh, standing up for athletes. And my father would always say that how mistreated he was by the other athletes. But when he had an opportunity to speak on behalf of other athletes, he did. And he, and he raised the social consciousness. And they give you a little shot and give you a little money and you really think you're living, you know. And I mean, you don't want to care about anybody else. You just want to be out there and enjoy that stuff because you've been given an entree level that's not on the top, but at least you're kind of in the ball game. So there's a lot of things to fight to bring about the kind of unity that I'm talking about and the economic support that blacks need. The NFL has said players are encouraged but not required to stand for the anthem. Until 2009, no NFL players stood for the national anthem. The players were moved to the field during the national anthem because it was seen as a marketing strategy to make the athletes look more patriotic. There's substantial evidence of African-American athletes being courageous, standing up for what they believe, and many will silently protest in support of Colin Kaepernick. The more people do it, I can guarantee you that the rest of the population will take notice and you start talking about it in other communities other than African-American communities, things can get done.
You are important. You make a difference. This matters. Everything you do matters. Look out for one another. Lift each other up. That's what this is about.